it's really good. I uh, had a couple of busy days uh, working on some new mixes and stuff, but uh, yeah, it's going really well. So, yeah. At the moment, really, really cool. You're a, you're a busy man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I had a lot of work. Like, uh, the mixes are kind of really coming on at the moment. Yeah. Uh, and uh, kind of, uh, yeah, been getting a lot more work, so I'm really enjoying it. That's it's good. Really cool. So how did you get interested in music and remixing? Um, I started off, I've always kind of been singing and kind of writing music from a really early age. I was kind of trained classically. Yeah. And kind of learned the piano and some other like bits and bobs. Um, and then kind of got into DJing when I was a teenager, about 10 years ago. Mm -hmm. um, just always loved music. Um, and I kind of started getting into doing mashups and bootlegs. Yeah. And I kind of posting them on MySpace and online and things mm -hmm. like that. And I just kind of built up a bit of a following, really. Um, yeah. And the more kind of people that seem to like my mixes, the more I was doing. And then I nearly had a bootleg that was released, uh, the track I did for Justin Timberlake. Oh, yeah. Um, but they didn't realise that it contained a sample and another track. And I kind of noticed that as much as people were liking my work, I couldn't really get stuff released. Yeah. I pushed my sound and tried to do some more original productions. Mm -hmm. and yeah, I kind of did a mix for... Uh, Justin Timberlake, Sierra, Love, Sex, Magic, that was kind of the big one that I got released. Yep. Um, and kind of posted that, gave it out to kind of everyone that I knew. And yeah. And kind of a week, so I had a phone call from Sierra's manager, Tony BMG, Tony wanted to release the track, and it's just kind of all flown from there. Yeah. And that water house at the moment, and uh, yeah, it's been just going amazingly well since Yeah. Then. That's cool. So was that something that you just got your hands on the parts and did the mix, and then they found it and wanted to release it, or...? No, oh, it's kind of, I know it's because I was doing a lot of kind of unofficial stuff, just kept kind of yeah. posting like, to get it released. Um, so yeah, I just kind of got hold of the acapella. Nice. My production over the top. Yeah. Uh, obviously since then now I kind of get the get, part. Yeah, get it on the, on the reel. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's, that's, cool. that's kind of how it come about really, so I was really lucky I think. Yeah. Um, yeah. Nice. So, um, <laughs> How does the remix process work for you? Do you sort of have a set idea of what direction you want to go before you start, or you? Yeah, I think out I kind of listen to the track first. If I can get sort of the original track, I'll have a listen to that to kind of get a feel uh, of, of how the track kind of flows. Yeah. Uh, and and then generally I'll just kind of have a bit of a play around uh, with some chords, ideas, that kind of thing. See how it works. Um, I'll then kind of work on some beats. Yeah. To get that kind of sorted. Um, and then I'll kind of listen to the vocal arrangement mm -hmm. uh, try and kind of fit the music around the vocals um, and then just kind of see what happens really. Um, I don't kind of generally have a set process. I mean some mixes will take longer than others. Yeah. Um, I'm quite a bit of a perfectionist so when I kind of do a mix I have a listen back and just kind of see how it kind of fits and then work from there. Yeah. Uh, but that's kind of how it generally works. So um, I know that you've, after you got the Sierra one, obviously the doors open. I know you did Mariah and Beyonce yeah. and Mika. Um, so yeah. who else is on the list of people that you'd like to work with? I'd like to work with. Um, I am a massive fan of David Goethe at the moment, actually. Yeah. Um, as a producer. I mean, his tracks at the moment are kind of blazing. Yeah. Um, great to kind of do some stuff with him. Um, I'm a big fan of Justin Timberlake as well, actually. Yeah. Oh, oh. Um, I love my R and B, my kind of soulful kind of stuff as well. Uh -huh. That would be some uh, good artists to work for. Kelly Rowland, love her. Yeah. Uh, that would be cool. Um, yeah, it'd be nice. I think also to maybe do something that people might not necessarily expect. Yeah. Um, just finished doing a remix with Michael Bublé at the moment. Oh wow. Um, which is something a little bit interesting. I'm yeah, quite that's a little bit different. <laughs> like yeah, and that's the, the same thing I was doing with like the bootlegs and the mashup. But I love kind of putting together ideas that doesn't necessarily people think they'll work, but yeah. when you kind of you're like, yeah, so that would be really cool. That's cool. Um, so you, we're talking about mashups before, which is um, one of your favourites that you did of those back in the day? Or? Ooh, <laughs> um, idea mashup comes to mind of uh, Akon, Smack yeah. That with an uh, old school track by the night calls just a feeling on that I think Pitbull used in his track, the hotel yeah. track. Um, and that, I think that was probably one of my other biggest mashups uh, posted on YouTube. And the guy from the night has actually got in touch with me and he wanted to try and release the track. Oh, wow. <laughs> um, but I think he was having problems trying to get in touch with Akon's label and yeah. all 
that. But um, yeah, I kind of heard that was kind of a bit of a, a big sort of somewhere around in Greece and Falaraki and some other oh, places. Wow. <laughs> I think that's probably my favourite one, and that was kind of the one I think that kind of got me a bit more noticed. Yeah. On the kind of Cool. Well, that's a surprise to hear from someone from the Night Crawlers, I'm sure. <laughs> oh, no, no. I mean, because they were quite big in the 90s. Yeah, they were. I remember. Yeah. <laughs> Love them. Yep. <laughs> so, um, I know you mentioned David Guetta before. What other um, producers and remixers right now do you think are doing good work? I really like the sound of Cascade. Yeah. Dead Mouse? Yeah, yeah, I have. I've heard. really like their production. Uh, they're really, really cool. Uh, the White Boys on my label. Yep. Love their stuff, love their sound. Yep. I think the kind of sound that they're doing is really fresh. Yeah. Um, there's a new guy coming on the scene, I think he's been around a while, called Chucky. Uh, Chucky. I think he's going to be really big. I'm liking some of the stuff that he's coming up with. Um, I think it's really interesting because I think at the moment the whole kind of dance scene is becoming kind of like pop music. Pop music, yeah. So exactly. it's great, I think, that we're getting crossovers now with a lot of like the R&B artists and the pop artists kind of collaborating with the, the dance producers. And yeah. Things. So I think there's a lot more kind of exciting stuff. To get about. That is cool. Um, so what other um, new tracks are you getting your hands on? What have you been working on? Can you share uh, anything else with us? <laughs> yeah, it's more exclusive, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've just done a mix with Sean Kingston and Justin Bieber's track. Oh, wow. I think it's just come out on Friday night. Yep. Um, obviously, I've done the Nika track uh, for you guys yep. as well. Mm-hmm. Coming out um, in Korea, so, I think. Yeah. Really mm-hmm. out there. Um, I did a mix with Tony Braxton, I think that's just come out as a bonus track on her album, Pulse. Cool. Um, uh, done, I did Macy Gray Beauty in the World, I think. Yeah. Number four in the field of dance charts. Yeah, it's done pretty well over here. Yeah. Pretty well. Um, I just mixed her next track called Lately, which is just coming out on promo here in cool. the UK. I'm not sure when it's coming out to you guys in the US. Yeah. Um, and I've also done a track for a guy called Jason Dotley for you guys. Oh, as well. yeah. Yep. Uh, he's a great guy, a really, really great guy. I really yeah, enjoy working. A good mix, I like that one. Cool. Yeah, yeah, you heard that. Yeah, yeah really, really good. Good fun song, so uh, I think that track hit play for really soon. Yeah. yeah, keep myself. I'm gonna dance tonight. Get lost up in the light.